so let's do that. Um, for the text, what I did was uh, just uh, double click here and then double click on the material and uh, go to color and then where it says texture, this little arrow, click on it, load image, and, this is next guy. and I use this Crash image. And yeah, it's kind of a grungy, rusty metal or something like that, or uh, acid kind of metal, I don't know. Um, so, just click on it and exposure, I don't know, no, we don't need exposure. Maybe just a little bit. And um, for texture, no wait, and then go to reflection. Select the reflection and then go to uh, same thing texture here and um, select Frenzel and um, maybe you want to reduce reflection by a little bit. Oops, make this a hundred make strength, but reflection a little bit less. So you can change the color of reflection. Uh, I'm just gonna keep it black and uh, black and white so then drag it onto the text all of the tracks you hear on this podcast are unreleased Many of mm, let's see what it looks like when it's rendered looks pretty nice never had anything commercially released. looks all right one or two like this one are yeah kind of like that so um We've had a few things released now recently. with the spheres double click on the uh, material at the uh, where it says color, go to texture and to go down to friend cell and you can change the colors uh, let's say for white we can make it uh, blue and now it looks blue and black and for black you can make it uh, gray so, oh wait, and reflection, add reflection and uh, go to texture and go down to friend cell Pretzel is uh, the one that I like to use the most, so maybe you can change the color of reflection. No, <laughs> looks kind of dumb. Uh, let's see what that looks like. Uh, I, love going through I don't like that visit. black thing like in the middle. So just gonna. What is that? That is weird. Um, I'm just gonna change this to black and this to white. So, let's see. It's alright. Looks alright. Um, no, same thing with the others. Just go to color, texture, and so. Um, change the color um, maybe you can change this color let's see what that looks like and then reflection just mess around with all these the way you like it so um, maybe let's see what that okay oh that looks actually better than this one so <laughs> because in color here I changed the color where it was black to red so now in the middle it's not black anymore, it's uh, red and on the edge it's either white or uh, kind of grayish color. Yeah, I like that. And then the last one, uh, color, and so, uh, let's change this to purple. And this to gray and reflection. To maybe let's try gradient. Let's see what that looks like. Oops. Um, make strength. All of the tracks you hear. Blue in this, which is kind of. Uh, Blurriness. You can you, you can have blurriness. So, or producers who've never had um, anything commercially released. Yeah. One or two like this one. I don't like gradient. Let's just producers. go to go back to Frenzel and the color. Yeah. 
Will I just leave it like that and okay, get onto the last uh, ball and yeah, because this heal looks pretty nice. So this is probably it for the text making and now how to make it a picture. Go to rendering settings, output 1280. 720. <laughs> Excuse me. Um. Now aspect. Yeah. And current frame. Then yeah, zero to zero frames. And then save. And just name it. And then I uh, choose desktop or whatever, wherever you want to save it. And then um. Uh, where it says format, change it to JPEG or um, any other uh, picture format. But I like to use JPEG, or you can use Photoshop. Uh, if you use Photoshop, you can just uh, you can just place it into Photoshop right away. It's going to be a Photoshop file, but I'm just going to use JPEG and um, analyzing still image best options change the ray depth to 15 and 15 and then reflection depth to 5 so now we can render this that's it it's done we got a picture as you see it looks uh, pretty cool so uh, thank you for watching this tutorial and our tutorial setting up